Good evening and welcome to Hungary Report, start of public media and once foreign language news hour. I'm Cenge Gabriela Iboya with today's news from Hungary and the Carpathian Basin. Let's begin. Once again, the number of newly infected people was below 2,000. According to data published on Wednesday, 1,894 new infections were registered. 154 people lost their lives. The number of active cases also decreased, as the number is around 185,000 currently. The number of those being treated in hospitals also dropped below 7,000, as currently 6,727 people are being looked after in healthcare institutions. We've come to a decisive point in our battle. The first shipment of vaccinations will arrive to the country in three days, announced Prime Minister Viktor Orban after meeting with the operative body. The body has now approved the vaccination plan, meaning healthcare workers will start receiving the vaccine on the 27th of December. The first shipment will contain 10,000 vaccines. The first round of people to receive it will be doctors, nurses and those working in intensive care units. Mass vaccinations will begin later, but the operative body asks everyone who wishes to get their vaccine to register themselves on www.vaccinainfo.hu. Teachers can now register themselves for the free and voluntary COVID testing, which will take place after the winter holidays. The set date is on the 2nd and 3rd of January. 99 testing locations nationwide will await those working in public education. The aim is to try and filter out positive asymptomatic infections. Teachers can register on petsuris.kh.gov.hu until the 30th of December. There are a lot of Hungarian truck drivers stuck in the crowded queue at the port of Dover and along the surrounding roads. One of these drivers told M1 that they are already starting to make peace with the thought of having to spend this year's Christmas without their loved ones. Meanwhile, several Hungarians living in Britain decided to help and shop for those who could not leave their truck, as there were even instances of those who needed medicine such as insulin. And finally, the countdown to Christmas is almost over, with preparations coming to an end. Many have left shopping to the very last minute because of the pandemic. People still have a chance to shop a bit on Thursday, as stores will be open until 2 o'clock in the afternoon, but the stores will be closed on the 25th and 26th of December. Only gas stations, on-call pharmacies and restaurants will be open. This year, many people decided to order in rather than cook their festive menu, and for safety's sake, many decided to give up on large family gatherings. And that's all for now, but don't forget you can catch Hungry Reports every night after 11 o'clock news and online as always. Do stick around and watch our German, Russian and Chinese language news. Thank you for watching. Please remember to wear your mask and keep a safe distance, especially if you're visiting family in the upcoming days. Happy Christmas.